Ernie doesn't want to teach you how to lesson plan. He wants to teach you where to put those plans. Ernie used curriculum or the program of study as a first step to extract objectives and organize them into Microsoft OneNote. Then he'd take an objective and build his lesson around it using smart notebook templates. Next, Ernie would share his daily lessons with parents and students using eBoard. Ernie also used Google Drive to help store samples of student work, but that's for later. First, we're going to pull up a program of study. I've already done so. We're going to look at the program of study here, or just scroll down here. Let's open up social studies. And here we'll have the parent resources, the program resources, grade five. Open that up. Physical geography of Canada. So, here's where we're going to start cutting and pasting. Like that. And dropping it over here. So, this is what we're going to see. So here's our geography, place to put our resources. Here are our history objectives, places to put our history, identity. This is what it looks like before you start fixing it. I wish they would put these in a little better user-friendly format. Anyway, so identity resources, current events, current event resources, skills and processes. So these are the things that they want you to do. So you can look at these, analyze specific local and current affairs with a variety of sources distinguishing from fact and opinion. So it's as simple as that. Take your curriculum objectives from here and cut and paste in here. So you'll see that we have all the subjects lined up here and the specific learner objectives are here. So let's begin with the end in mind. This is what we want to do is we want to set up files with all of the subjects that we teach and then subsections for their curriculum objectives or resources or, or what have you. So let's go to the beginning and we'll scroll down to add a notebook, go to new, Let's take a yellow, and this is just a test, and we're going to create it. So, here we have our new notebook, and so this is with the other ones. And so we can add a section to that test. Test one. And go and create it here so we can keep adding pages and there you have it so under here you would add sections and here you add pages and you title it here and it'll appear here simple let's go back and this is what we want to see in the end <laughs>